For many people, dropping temperatures cause an increase in systems in symptoms rather associated with a particular health condition. Psoriasis is the most common autoimmune disease. News Channel 60's Ashley Osborne is in the studio now, and Ashley, psoriasis is more than just a skin condition. Hey, Jenny, psoriasis affects people of all races, ages, lifestyles. You've probably seen the commercials with celebrities who struggle with it. Probably the most recognized golfer, Phil Mickelson. Millions of Americans have psoriasis, and the doctors of the Medical College of Georgia are working on better ways to treat it. It's just hard. Sylvester Bush Jr. describes how psoriasis affects everyday things in a big way. Trying to bend your hands to you know, wrap around the steering wheel or whatever, it hurts. Even sleeping at night, it hurts. For Bush, the problem started on his knees and then spread to his whole body, which can make even a trip to the grocery store embarrassing. I know people, you know, they look and like, hey, what's wrong? And and I can understand that, but at the same time, it hurts as well. Dermatologist Dr. Loretta Davis says the condition can be difficult to manage. It's not that easy to turn around. There are lots of varieties. Often the medications are expensive, and insurance fights pitching in. They have a lot of comorbidities, meaning that their psoriasis may be also a risk factor for cardiac disease. And so all this inflammation in the body is affecting not only their joints and their skin, but their heart. And they need these medications. Which is why researcher Dr. Wendy Bolag's work is a game changer. The more tools we have, the better we're going to be able to take care of our patients. Dr. Bolag is studying how phosphatidylglycerol could help psoriatic patients by reducing inflammation. We thought that maybe phosphatidylglycerol would be able to inhibit inflammation induced by some of these danger signals, these antimicrobial peptides, and in fact that's what we found. And leaves out the negative side effects that come with many current drugs. But we think it should be really safe because it is naturally occurring, it's already in the body. Bush is grateful. <laughs> yeah. They're trying to help make life easier for him and others. What is your encouragement to someone who maybe just found out that they have psoriasis? My encouragement is don't be afraid to go and get help. You guys, Bush so positive. He says he hopes his story inspires someone else experiencing some of the things that he just described to ditch the fear of the unknown and go get treated. He's thankful he did because he says Dr. Davis has him on a medication and it's helping. Jenny.